You know, reinvention is a big word that everyone needs to consider right now. Uh, we look at the economic change. We look at the breakdown in the family structure today. We see youth out there that have lost their way. Um, they don't see how to get things on, on track. We see young men that are, are, are you know, moving aimlessly through life and a lot of young ladies, which I know you have a great passion for. Yes, I do. And then we see people in the business world that are trying to figure things out. We got people with master's degrees that are working as receptionists today. What do you think about all of this and what role does reinvention play? How important is this? Before we get into how to do it, how important is reinvention? It's not only important, it is necessary. And I think we sometimes overuse words, Michael, when we say reinvention, right. reinvention. It kind of like it's a like buzzword. A, yes, yeah. right. but there is something so fundamental about that word reinvention that we sometimes lose sight of. Hmm. And it's like the evolution of life when you go from being a toddler to, you know, being a, a young adult. Teenager, right. Yeah. There's a reinvention that takes place there. But in our lives, the importance of that is is that in order to grow, in order to get better at anything in life, it doesn't matter what that is, right. you have to reinvent yourself. And it's really, um, I think, goes back to what I just said, growth. It's about you always want to be learning and re-empowering yourself. Mm. And I think that's even a better, empowering yourself to get the most out of your life.